lasers, 192 of them, all aiming toward a tiny capsule the size of a BB. The reason? Not world destruction, but a clean energy source for the future, nuclear fusion. The National Ignition Facility, or NIF, at Lawrence Livermore Lab started operating last May. Its goal, to heat a small container of hydrogen with lasers to start a nuclear fusion reaction. And as recently reported online in the journal Science, firing the lasers at 40% capacity at the small container has been successful. Nuclear fusion powers our sun and other stars, and scientists hope it could someday power our homes. Instead of splitting atoms, as happens during fission reactions in nuclear power plants, nuclear fusion works to merge two atoms. The experiment at NIF works by focusing the 192 lasers at a gold cylinder containing a capsule with a small amount of special forms of hydrogen called deuterium and tritium. It heats up that capsule to the temperature of the core of the sun, over 20 million degrees, and it causes the atoms to move and then touch or fuse. It's the fusing that releases the energy. A lot of energy. Some believe that fusion could be the perfect source of energy in the future. Unlike nuclear fission, fusion produces no radioactive waste, and unlike coal, hydrogen is plentiful, and fusion releases no CO2 into our atmosphere. Harnessing this energy safely has been the largest concern in the past, but with this important first step, scientists at NIF hope that a functioning nuclear fusion power plant may be only a decade or so away.